This can be a complicated problem because we really want to just see X's or just Y's. They're usually asking us to find a point where, you know, what's the solution for this? Like X is 3 and Y is 9 or something like this. So what we want to do is get rid of one of these. So if I multiply all of the bottom one by 2, this would become 10, and multiply all of this by 5, this will become 10, and we can get rid of it. But that seems like large numbers. Here, I just need to get this up to 6. Double this and triple this. So, I'm going to take this first one and go like this. Multiply all of this by 3, all of this by 2, okay? Because we're aiming to get rid of these. 3 times 6x, 3 times 2y is 6y. 3 times 12 is 36, okay? Now, 2 times 5x is 10x. 2 times 3y is 6y. 2 times 26 is 52. Not bad so far, right? So, what do we do? We're going to subtract the bottom line. So if I subtract, 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 we have a negative 4x. This goes away, and we have 36 minus 52 for a negative 16. 4 times negative 4 gives you negative 16. So x equals 4. We just have to put it upstairs. If this becomes 4 here, this is 8 plus 2y is 12. 8 plus 2y equals 12. That's got to be a 2. See that? 2 times 2 is 12. So the point that will be in our answer is x, y. 4, 2. Hope you enjoy that.